trust you're ready to go. We are leaving soon. Mr. Geddes, he is an odd one. Well, just one last look, sizing up this place. If I run into any furniture, I want to be prepared to purchase, you know what I mean? All right, let us prepare to be away. We have a long journey to Winterhold. All right, what have we got that we can get rid of? This without doubt. That. These gauntlets are interesting. Alchemy. Oh, of course. Ooh, looting. Excellent. Yes. We are learning much, men. Learning much. Now, Mr. Fenno, are we prepared to go, or it's what? It's been a while, Outlander. What? Looking to unleash some havoc across Tamriel again? Oh, I see how it is. Teldron Cero, Blade for Hire. Oh, come if off If you it. have the coin, I'm at your service. I see what you're doing here. Yes, this is a passive-aggressive way to hint that I haven't paid you in some time, is it not? Well, fine. Then let's be off. Oh, stop this farce, Mr. Cero. I am right behind you. So transparent. Please. If you need to be paid, just ask. Okay? I understand. We're, we're very busy, okay? Sometimes oh. it slips my mind. It's not on purpose. All right. We are preparing for the road. Backpack hat. I suppose a cloak would be a good thing now. Hmm? All this walking. I wish there was a silk strider around here. Goodness. Let's see. Let us take these valuables, which will leave them here. That's good. Locked away, safe and sound. Come, gentlemen, let us be away. Ah, Mr. Geddes, excuse me. All right, Mr. Voltana. Hello. Yes, we should be leaving. We should be away for a while. Are you tired of something? How can I help? Uh, look, has the inn made any money? What? Not recently. Check back later. What do you mean? I checked yesterday. You're telling me we didn't make any money overnight? Very well. <laughs> Your investor's a pain in the ass, is he not? <laughs> and, <coughs> what is this? It seems quite menacing to have this mannequin right before the door. I recommend you move it. It's going to scare patrons. No wonder we're not making any money. <laughs> it's odd. All right. Come. Oh. Like the weather's going to be beautiful today. All right, gentlemen, let's get ourselves in order. Uh, Couch Warrior, if you wouldn't mind walking the good people through perk selection, that'd be great. Thank you. All right, Marl, we can do that. Probably good to level up now, anyway. Okay, so... I think that what we're going to do for Marl here is we're going to... Invest in a little health. Health investment. 
that is an indication of his growing fortitude or strength. And we have some options here. I'm, I'm thinking, ob obviously, continuing to invest here in Conjuration or in Destruction to make him a, poor, a more potent Destruction spellcaster. We also have some Enchanting, which we've been following a track here that is designed to kind of help Marl with his staff usage. I don't think we have much we can do here, however. So we'll hold off on that. Now, we can also potentially invest more in one-handed. He has been using the sword quite a bit. However, I think this time around, I'm inclined to invest in destruction. I believe we invested in one-handed last time around. So, let's see what we can do, if anything. To increase his potency here. Actually, not much. We still, we need more levels, I think, in destruction. Force of nature was something that we took as a means of getting us to elemental specialization, but he is not equipped to go that route yet either. Conjuration may be it at this point. So let's have a look. We've got Bone Collector. We could go with another base level in Conjuration Mastery. Let's do that. So I think that's it. Um, back to you, Marl. Thank you, Couch Warrior. That was excellent. Followers, let us go. The League of Prodigious Illumination is on the move. All right, we must maneuver this cart around once again. I shall have to talk to the Brothers Carpathian to see if perhaps we could create some kind of roundabout here. Wouldn't that be nice to have a roundabout where we could just simply turn the cart around conveniently and head off in the other direction? Okay. Uh, Mr. Thero, uh, carefully please. I, I see what you're attempting. It could be hard on the adventure wagon. Okay. Delicately, delicately. All right. Well executed. Oh, and look. The weather has cleared up a bit. That's good. All right. So, what is on the agenda for today? The League of Prodigious Illumination makes its way to the Mage College, located in Winterhold. I wonder what became of Saint Gia. He's probably at the Mage College. I'm sure that you shall meet him once we get there, Mr. Thero. I anticipate that. Mm-hmm. All right. Uh, I, I believe we know how to get there, Mr. Thero. Are you clear on where you need to go? So I don't have to worry myself about that. That's good. What I'm hoping is that we should get up there and find some other learned people. Oh, hold up, Mr. Thero. Mr. Thero, pause for a moment. I wish to look at the valley. How lovely. We have picked a rather picturesque place to make home, don't you think? Cold but beautiful nonetheless. And where we are going is going to be colder, so be prepared, men. Now, as I was saying, uh, being around some other learned people and having access to study materials and books and manuscripts and artifacts and things like that would be a great thing. I'm hoping to learn more that might help me in my research of the Lorcan Particles. My objectives here are twofold. I would like to understand the nature of the law, Lorcan particles in more depth, but I would also watch out for this gentleman. 
Let us ogle him. Oh, he is grotesque. <laughs> oh, that was mean of me. I should not have said that. Oh, goodness. Oh, my goodness. Rocks. Uh, but I would also like to understand more about the nature of models' ability to detect the Lorcan particles. The detection of the Lorcan particles is almost more curious than the particles themselves. I should love to find a way to amplify that effect. It is quite frustrating when I am alerted to the presence of the particles only to be foiled in finding the source. If I could find a way to increase that sensitivity or the range of said sensitivity, that would help us significantly in our research, don't you think? Although, I'm not sure exactly how to explore that avenue without, of course, experimenting on myself, which could be quite dangerous. <laughs> but potentially very illuminating. So, I don't know. So I hold out hope that buried in some of these obscure manuscripts I might find some processes research rituals that might help me if you ever get in these studies. It. It's Is it really? Mr. Cero, I am going to try very hard to keep my sarcasm in check. Understand, it's not easy for me. Oh, shit. Everyone, we must deal with this. that wolf. Oh, we crushed him. Interesting. Now, I did hear Lorcan particles are present. There. Look. What have I got prepared? Hmm. It seems to be... Well, I only detect one signature, but that does not mean he is the only one. We shall go with flames. My really nasty staff has limited charges. I feel as though I must save them up just in case. Come, gentlemen. The LPI is on the case. Yes, up ahead. I believe it is a thief of some kind. Ah, look at you. Ah, you missed. But I got you. <laughs> I got Ruth. That is correct. Look, it is a thief. An Argonian one. Huh. Well. Oh. A note. Who shall take that? All right, men. This is going to be invasive surgery, but I must take this sample. Are we all okay with that? I'm going to have to use my good sword here. I think it's the only thing that's capable of performing this kind of surgery, so <laughs> we should do that. All right. Ready? Uh, slice here, slice there, and boom. We have a hip bone. A good sample, I should think. This is a curious place to stage a thievery ambush, don't you think? Quite odd. Hmm. Well, hold on. Let us see this note. Hmm. As instructed, you are to eliminate Marlevoe Kindred by any means necessary. The Black Sacrament has been performed. Somebody wants this poor fool dead. We've already received payment for the contract. Failure is not an option, Astrid. What? Who would want model dead? That... 
That is not a thief, that is an assassin. Oh, goodness. Look it. It is an assassin. Oh, model is no fool. At least not most of the time, anyway. <laughs> Th this is the Dark Brotherhood. Well, who would want Model dead? I mean, what have I done but refetch? Oh, this is most disturbing. Come, we must head out. It is dangerous to stay in this place, I think. He may not be the only assassin present. Come. Oh, this is most vexing. <sighs> Quickly, I, I wish to get to the Mage College. Perhaps we should find some extra security within the walls of the college. Until we can sort out this mess. Come. Who would want old model dead? I mean... Badly enough to hire a Dark Brotherhood assassin? Hmm. Well, let us think about oh, this logically. I wish there was a Silt Strider around here. If we are considering motivation, perhaps. There is a mysterious party that does not wish me to further my lock on research. Could that be it? Is my research into the lock on particle somehow a threat to someone? Hmm. Am I not a jovial person? Am I not likable? I mean, we discussed this. Of course. I mean, I can be somewhat eccentric and perhaps annoying at times, but <laughs> that's not a killing offense, is it? It must be my research. It's the only thing I can think of that could drive such a thing. I mean, really, let's be honest. Hmm. Curious. Well, this is really... Disturbing. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Quickly. I sense a threat. Everyone off. We must meet the threat head on. Oh, arrows. Arrows, gentlemen. Quickly. Quickly. Oh, goodness. Dispatch that Arthur archer. Quickly. Or it kills the horse. I'm going to cook you. Free. Skeleton, you're free. Oh, shit. Mages. Mages. I need some support. Mr. Thero, support, please. Mr. Thero. See you, burn. you will see me burn, is that it? I shall see you burn. And you as well. Oh, I think I should go to something... More potent. If I am to survive this. Yes, here we go. Oh, you are in for th some treats now. If I can hit you, damn it. And I wasted my spell. I feel quite useless, to be honest. Quite useless indeed. Alright, come. <clears throat> Alright. Well, I shall think. Old model. We'll stick to the basics.
Why would they attack us? An attack of opportunity? Perhaps they're thinking to take our valuables? Hardly seems like the province of mages, does it? Ah. There's another one right there. Old model is coming. Yes. Joy. Gentlemen. Take care of that if you would. Eh, language, Mr. Wack. Language. Alright. Oh, lovely. Look at it. These are nice. I should take them. Two styles of very nice goblets. Three of each. Beautiful bowls. What's in here? Nothing. Ah. I took a shot there. I'm feeling a bit, um... A bit loopy. Let us fix that. Oh, that's better. Thank you. Thank you very much. Now, what's your issue? Hmm. Look at this armor. I wonder if anyone would buy this. I'm going to take it. It looks as if these mages were fully prepared to take many prisoners. My guess is for gruesome experiments. They just hadn't gotten around to it yet. Salt. That's good. And carrots. We should take your carrots. Flour. They have many provisions. Yes, we are taking your provisions and your pride. Yes, we are. What is this? Tomato. Potato. <laughs> hmm. What are these things? They look potions. Quite good. Quite good indeed. How about some wine, Mr. Seto? Should we take the wine? Why not? It looks like it's still uncorked. If it was if it was open, I wouldn't take it. We don't need some necromancer's backwash. <laughs> That's disgusting, really. Okay. Well. Let us explore the rest of this place. Axes. Good to keep on hand. Maybe some extra firewood. Hmm. Weapons. We can take these and sell them. Loot away, gentlemen. Feel free. Oh, another goblet. Now we have a complete set of four. So we can have dinner parties. I love dinner parties. And books. Gods and worship. I believe I have this, but we're going to take extra copies of these books. I simply love the idea of taking literature away from miscreants and distributing it amongst the populace. It feels inspired. What's with all these empty bottles? I should like to have full ones. Well. All right. Oh, gentlemen, careful. Now, observe. Observe my technique as I rush the room. I shall charge in first and engage the enemy, and you follow me. Ready? Go! Uh, uh, wait! Ooh, yes, I... <laughs> it's empty. All right. Well... Thought. Tato, how about you? You are empty. What am I doing? 
All right, Mr. Wack, how are you? Looking good. If anyone need a skull, there seems to be an ample supply of skulls here, should we need them. All right. Ah, lanterns. Extra lanterns. That's good. Ooh, red apples. Oh, I love those. <laughs> I love red apples. Okay. Let us explore the upper area of this fortress. It's hard to imagine why they are not connected internally. That makes no sense. How inconvenient that a person must walk outside and brave the elements. Hmm. Should take your dagger as well. Brave the elements and walk uphill. I wonder what became of Saint Gio. I met him once, you know. Yes, I know. ready. It is quiet. Hey, look. These are caught. I should take them. Unopened. Ooh. I like those very much. Hmm. Tomatoes. Tomatoes. What's in here? Salt. Empty. Empty petals. Why? Take. Hmm. This must be where their leader was. Housing himself. Grey robes. It's good to have options, I think. Goblet. Well, that's no good. Now we have a set of five. Who invites an odd number of people to a dinner party? That's unseemly. Okay. Uh, yes. That's That's good. I fear it's not a full soldier. Uh, help me ingredients. I'll take those. Scroll. More ingredients. Yeah. All right. Now, quiet, everyone. Let us proceed. It's caution. Hello. Oh, it's empty. Well. Okay, it's the, this is a big place, and yet uh, there were only three mages here. I wonder what they were up to. Now I'm quite curious. Hmm. Well, this is quite a haul. We uh, should not need food stuff for quite some time, I think. Come, let's check out this area up here. Oh, I see. There's a nice bowl for a set. Oh, yes. Always some kind of asinine ritual. Yes, we must do a ritual. We must shed blood so that we can be more powerful mages. That never really works in actual practice. At least, not that I have found. I have never found that somehow I am more powerful if only I could bleed first. <laughs> it's ridiculous. 
superstitious behavior. All right, I am a man of science. I have no time for rituals. What is that? Although, did I not say earlier that I was interested in manuscripts that might contain information about rituals? <laughs> silly model. Yes, I do contradict I myself sometimes. Most humorous. If you ever get the chance, you should visit. Me. Oh goodness! It's spectacular. I do hope I'm not senile. <laughs> oh, that would be bad. Uh, yes. Hmm. Well, hello, Folly. Nice of you to pull yourself right off the road. Very, very considerate of other travelers. I'm impressed. Now, let us stow this cargo. Uh, especially all this food. Get, get it put away and chilling, if you know what I mean. So many things we have acquired. I have to believe that our Khajiit friend back at the inn could make excellent use of all these items. All right, there's a lot of things here that we don't need to be carrying with us. Very good. This bandolier. Most curious. All right, everyone. Let us be off. All right. Now let's get this beastly wagon turned around, shall we? Oh, goodness. Yes, I am a bad driver, I understand. If, if you aren't going to complain about it, then take over. All right, men, I would like to thank you profusely for your excellent work in taking of that fortress. Understanding that your fearless leader is under threat from assassins, it touches my heart the way that you both stepped up. It was wonderful to see. It was awe-inspiring your courage and magnificence in battle. So, I thank you very much. Now, Mr. Fedo, if you wouldn't mind pausing for a moment. Behold that vista. Mr. Wack, look. Look. See? Isn't it beautiful? It must remind you of your home in some respects, right? The expanse of the water snow-covered hills and mountains. Yes. Wonderful. <sighs> All right, Mr. Cero, you may proceed. Well, I'm not exactly sure to do next. I mean, we go to the college. We proceed as planned. But must I look over my shoulder continually? Must I watch my back constantly now? Uh, uh oh. Mr. Wag, please. You see these beasts up here. Careful now. Stay away from that horse. 
Oh shit, everyone, off. I hear the beat of giant wings. Oh goodness. Come, come to me. I wonder what became of Saint Gia. Oh, there he is. Oh my goodness, look at him. He's huge. Come, come, come. I think it is time for this. Right. Gentlemen. Oh, we feel. We feel. Is he going to leave us alone? If he knows what's good for him, he is, that's for sure. Millie, please, if you wouldn't mind. Where did he go? Ooh. Yes. Run off, coward. Cowardly dragon. Yes. That is a dragon who displayed some wisdom, not taking on model or company. I am quite done with you. All right. Now. I find it interesting that he didn't attack. I can only assume that he is heard of Model's reputation as a slayer of dragons and ran in fright. That must be it, of course. Truly magnificent. Oh, there's the college. We are closer than I thought. Look at that thing. It's quite precarious, is it not? It looks like it's going to tip over. Well, let us continue. I would certainly like to enter town before nightfall, if at all possible. Wait. There. There is a signature. Come, everyone. We must deal with this issue. Hello, Mildred. We didn't get a chance to talk before, but uh, thank you for coming. Okay, are you ready? You look lovely. Oh, that is a great color on you. I'm sorry, I'm being disingenuous, am I not? <laughs> Come, let's see what is the fort here. Well, where is he? Is he underground or what? I wonder what became of Saint Gia. Who? I met him once, you know. Who should have come where? Hey, are you in there? Oh, you are. Yes, Mr. Cero, you started, or you finished what model started. Excellent teamwork. Hmm. All right, this is a gruesome business, but I'm chopping this arm off. There we go. And look at what we found. How interesting. Freshly roasted leg of goat, it's still hot. Who's doing in here? He seemed to be some kind of alchemist. Oh, look it. Treasure map. Another one of these masks. A silver one. Interesting. Shall we look at this map? I think we should. Uh, wait. I know that location. 
think so. Um, yes. This, this is a view of the two strange towers that span the river. You remember that, don't you? And this is obviously a view looking from east to west toward the city of Whiterun, indicating a hidden treasure, which we shall abscond with next time we are in the area. <laughs> what a find. Ooh, let's get back to our horse before it gets eaten by some creature. The last thing we need is poor Folly being missing. Look! That is a... Th the, 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 the shrine of Azura is right here. Oh, this is where... This is the place where Shadling came. Wow. He came much further north, north than I realized, I think. Oh my goodness. I wonder what he's going to do if he finds out there are assassins after me. He is quite protective. Almost scary in his protectiveness. I wonder what he would do. I shudder to think what he would do. I am going to have to do more research on this Dark Brotherhood for sure. I've heard of them. I understand their symbol, but I know very little of their culture, their organization. <laughs> we shall take some pelts. Poor unfortunate goat. All right, are we ready? Let's mount up, gentlemen. It is time to be away from here. We still have a ways to travel, so let's not tarry. Good job, Folly. You are quite the team player. I'm glad that I'm finally traveling with someone who seems competent. My last patron was killed trying to tackle an entire fort of bandits alone. Mm, yes. Good day. Timing. The weather's growing inclement. <laughs> wow. Ooh. Most excellent. We did it. 
Careful, Mr. Cero. Mind the guards and the chickens, please. Oh, goodness. Chicken crossing. Wait. To the end for a yeah, they're reforming the dog? Where else could I even go? Them guards will say something. Yes. Thank you for the information. Oh, goodness. Chicken. I grew up in the city of Black. Okay, straddle the chicken. Straddle the chicken. Careful. We did it. We straddled a chicken. Perfect. Oh, this weather is atrocious. Let's get up around the corner there by the main entrance and then we'll just take a load off, I think. Very good. Right, this looks great, I think. Okay. Disembark, everyone. Ah, much better. Ugh. To stretch my legs. Got to think. Maybe I'm the dragonborn, and I, I just don't know it yet. Really? I, I think it's quite possible you could be right. Perhaps you are the dragonborn. Yeah, let's look around a bit. What a mess. This place is an absolute mess. that at some point part of the town actually just simply collapsed down the mountain. I don't know if it, that's what ha happened, but something happened. is absolutely insane. Look at that madness. And yet they still use it. It looks... Perhaps they were right. It looks as if at one time this was connected and the bottom just literally dropped out. And somehow that bridge is still suspended. Could be powerful magic holding it in place, or it could be just the laws of physics somehow at play. Interesting. Well, now this looks like. Is this a, a shop? Let me guess. Someone stole your sweet home. No, they did not. You infernal man. Shove off. What an idiot. All right. Let's see. Gather up any gear you need to bring inside, men. Let us look and see. I feel as if our things are jumbled up. What is happening? Well, I have items here that I certainly don't need to bring in with me, I think. So, well, let us endeavor to put some of these things away.
There we go. That's much better. All right. Come, let's get inside the walls here. Oh, hello. Hello, how are you? Cross the bridge at your own peril. The way is dangerous and the gate will not open. You shall not gain entry. Why not? Why are you out here anyway? What's the point of this? I am here to assist those seeking the wisdom of the college. And Correct. if, in the process, my presence helps to deter those who might seek to do harm, so be it. I see. The more important question is, why are you here? Well... <laughs> I'm here because I would like to enter the college. Is that not obvious to you? Perhaps. But what is it you expect to find within? Knowledge, of course. I want to investigate. I want to unravel the mysteries of Aetherius and beyond. I want to discover the origin and power of the Lorcan particles and whatnot. Hmm? Ah, the immortal plane. It is said to be the source of all magic. Yes, I this know. This is a noble goal, indeed. Thank you. It would seem that the college has what you seek. The question now is what can you offer the college? Well, Not let's just see. anyone is allowed inside. Well, Those wishing to enter must show mean? some degree of skill with magic. Oh, I see. A small test, if you will. Fine. I'll take your test. Hmm. Hmm. Anyway. Excellent. Those invested in restoration magic find healing hands to be essential. Can you cast it on me? Healing that hands. would prove your skill. Uh I didn't think I know that one. <laughs> no? Well if you think you're capable of it, then I'd be happy to provide it to you for a mere thirty gold. Oh, I or see. Or you can try your luck with one of the court wizards around Skyrim. They also sell spells. Interesting shakedown you have going here. Yeah, okay, here's your here city you gold. Now I'm anxious to see you cast it. Yes. Ridiculous. No matter what. Well done indeed. I think you'll be a superb addition to the college. Welcome, apprentice. I'll lead you across the bridge. Once you're inside, you'll want to speak with Mirabel mm -hmm. Irvine, our master wizard. Mirabel, Please, yes, follow me. Yes, they will come to winter. Amen. <laughs> Mr. Seto, let's keep the sarcasm in check until we are in the privacy of our own rooms. <laughs> Look at her. There is something very alluring about an intelligent woman. Winter holds glory days may lie behind him, mm -hmm. but the college lives on. Are you a faculty here, my child? So, what the name? The college is an asset to Skyrim, even if it goes unnoticed or unappreciated. Mm-hmm. Yes. Okay, well. All right, now. Ooh, stay away from that hedge. Is this really the only way in? Mr. Thero, I feel as if we should tie ourselves together with a rope or something. All right. Here we go. Ready? Step lightly now. Step lightly. Careful. Okay. okay. Careful. Okay. Ah, okay. A goat! What is the goat doing up here? What? Quickly. That goat's weight may be the thing that causes it to drop. You never know. Come quickly, get off that bridge. I do believe we got here just in time. Weather is atrocious. 
Ah, oh, this is better. Just out of the wind, somewhat. Hold on, Legagen. Who is that? The guard? I believe I've made myself rather clear. Yes, of course. I'm simply trying to understand the reason behind the decision. You may be used to the Empire bowing to your every whim, but I'm afraid you'll find that Thalmor received no such treatment here. You are a guest of the College, here at the pleasure of the Archmage. I hope you appreciate the opportunity. Yes, of course. The Archmage... Ah, uh, Mr. Thero, that is a bit rude. Very good. Then we're done. What are you reading? Hello. Welcome to the college. Uh, excuse me. I'm standing here. Could you... Another new student. I'm surprised at how many of you there are lately. Well, first you'll need these. While you're not required to wear them, you may find them more to your liking than your current clothes. I doubt that. I'll give you a brief tour, and then we'll get you to your first class. Are you ready to begin? Um, actually, I'm here to do research. I am not, uh... I'm not exactly here to become a student. I'm doing research, you understand? So, yes, um, sure. Wonderful. Show me around. Please follow me and don't wander off. The College of Winterhold has been a fixture oh. in Skyrim for thousands of years. The prominent feature here is the Hall of the Elements. It's our primary location for lectures, practice sessions, and general meetings. The Arcanium is located above the hall, and the Archmage's quarters above that. While technically in charge of the college, the Archmage's responsibilities often keep him occupied. Thus, I run the day-to-day -day operations. Now, if you'll please follow me, I'll show you the living quarters. That is understandable. Had to oh, happy full of me. ...due to some problems with the local Nords. We don't anticipate any real violence, but it never hurts to be prepared. Hmm. So this is the fabled college of winter. My cousin's out fighting dragons, and what do I get? Our newest members are housed here, in the Hall of Attainment. I'll ask that you please keep your voice down while inside, as others may be working on Trouble. research or delicate experiments. All right. You do that. I understand the value of peace and quiet when doing research. Now uh, I'll show you to your quarters. Yes. You're going to be sharing space what? with your fellow apprentices, who you'll meet shortly. This is where you'll be staying. This really? bed and desk are yours. Please try and be considerate of others. Now, let's go back to the Hall of the Elements, where most of the members gather for lectures and study Goodness. sessions. This is a bit overwhelming, um, so in order to qualify for said room, I'm sure I need to be enrolled, is that it? <laughs> Where did she go? Initially, you'll be learning from Tolfdu, one of our most esteemed wizards. Uh, excuse me, miss. Could we provide some accommodations for my uh, my companions? Is that possible? I could pay out of pocket for extra beds if Talk that's not. Talk to already addressing the new apprentices. Go on in, and if you have any problems, let one of our senior members know. Well, yes, I, I need accommodations for my bodyguard and manservant there. We are the League of Prodigious Illumination. Hmm. Well, perhaps we shall have to make our own accommodations then, eh? All right, well, let's see what this college is all about.